Hello my beautiful Aries, welcome to my channel. This is your favorite fortune teller Divine Light and today I'm going to do a coffee cup reading and also a tarot reading to see overall energies and the blessings coming your way. At the end of your reading I'm going to pull the cards and get more clarity on your situation. Also I'm going to leave a link up here if you, and in the description box below. If you would like a private reading from me you can just go ahead and book your reading from there. And don't forget to subscribe if you're enjoying these videos because subscription is free and you can unsubscribe anytime you want. But it helps the channel a lot and also helps this message get to the ones who really need to hear it as well. Let's jump in right away and let's see what is coming your way. Alright guys, let's see. Hmm. I thought I saw a path opening here but then it turned out to be somebody showing up. This person is on top of another men's, like a bald men's head. And there's actually a stump, a tree stump here. Um, this can be something that has been cut off, okay? This can be like a resource that you had in your life, but it's been cut off. I see here there's a letter, kind of looks like um, the letter J. J is this way, right? No, the other way? No, yes. This looks like a letter J here, like Jane or Jake. There's a person's head face is heading towards another path, another way. Okay, this can be a resource that you had. There's an eye on there. Maybe you got evil eye on it and it just cut off and you're not getting anything out of it anymore. However, the whatever it is, it is actually going to create another idea for you. This actually head can represent... Um, another creative idea coming through that. I see a lamb's face here. Lamb usually indicates um, a sacrifice that you need to make. Sacrifice something lesser of a value in order to get something higher of a value. Sacrifice doesn't mean get rid of your valuables. It means that um, whatever is lesser of a value for you that you need to let go. So this idea can actually start to um, take, um, take uh, you know, be, you start to bring it to life i see there's so many people surrounding you this seems like like the timeline if you take it next 12 weeks for example we can say maybe the second third week but the timeline usually changes according to the people so you can reinterpret that the number two okay it can be two weeks two months two days if you're too close if you're feeling that is coming to you i see this kind of looks like a crescent moon but when i look at the head of it there is actually a massive fish here fish usually indicates money but at at the end of your efforts it's showing up here okay so you're starting to probably share this idea with people gathering energy this can be a place that you're working at maybe you are actually coming up with this creative ideas that is actually going to attract more um of your desiring to you maybe the people are going to be approving that i see here this kind of looks like a horse head but it has horns on top of it the horns is the ram the shape of it looks like a ram here to me uh, no not the ram i'm sorry the goat okay uh like the mountain goat with the long um uh, the, the horns it has this is actually capricorn energy capricorn can represent sometimes thinking overthinking something think something about something obsessively and um, maybe just fixing your mind on it but because it has a like a light silhouette here and there's a little like this is the goat and there's a horse next to it this will lead you to and there's another horse with horns here like uh, whatever it is that you have in your mind contemplating thinking about it writing it down is actually going to attract your heart's desire faster to you uh, because horses means wish fulfillment here i see that yes there's a smiley face here so whatever it is that you're thinking contemplating or maybe um, a creative thing that you have in your mind you keep like walking towards it taking action towards it is actually going to start bearing fruit um seems like here okay i see there are two people actually packing up and coming towards you and there's a bird behind them and there's actually this seems like a um like a car initially like an old school now i see like a heel here you can see that the, here the, there's a shoe this can be uh i don't know if you're planning i don't really see any international interstate path here but news are coming forward here so if you're planning to do business with outside of where you usually uh, live this can be also a business um offer coming forward for you okay I see here there's a path also opening unexpectedly after the shoe comes through. Maybe you're going to go somewhere and then you're going to pick up the business and bring it to you. And I see a woman here sitting on 
like there's a letter V it's forming this can be also we can see it as a man if you look at this part and he's actually negotiating talking to someone there's a dog in between this can be someone who's actually going to be the connecting connection um someone loyal to you he's kind of leaning towards you the dog so it can be someone that is actually going to be covering your side supporting you and number eight is visible and then the fish here appears it means material satisfaction so this can be like a business deal that is actually going to give you a lot of satisfaction at the end of the day okay but whatever that idea that you have you need to just write it down put it on paper and maybe even start sharing with people because i see that you're sharing with a lot of people here and then it's gonna actually start to take shape okay let's get into your plate now if you have a question a desire an intention hold it in your mind let's see what the answer is going to be there is actually a protection bubble here this is kind of reminds me of that um is that the disney there is this um like a castle and the mountains on the background here that you have you are being surrounded and protected here i see someone who looks like a mountain as well someone very powerful actually uh looking like you're there under you and they're looking up to your success the mountain that you're climbing here you are standing right here very strong this can be someone also very powerful and admiring your power and appreciating uh, this can be maybe if you're manifesting an upgrade at work maybe a promotion someone who's actually going to offer it to you they have this um trident type of like tool in their hand trident usually symbolizes um the poseidon can be a water sign cancer pisces scorpio also can be someone who has like a power to dominate the waters um i don't know if you do anything with the water this doesn't have to be like that this can be also like a dominate the place that you're working maybe they have a real good power there kind of the face is looking a little bit like um, evil here but now i see there's someone paddling a boat. There are three people here. This three can be like three of pentacles. Maybe you need to form this partnership with three different people um, in the place that you are in. I see a letter H here. H as in Harry. R also. And somebody is jumping with joy here. So either way, the things are going to be working out for you. Okay. I see like a person who has a feather on top of their head. Feather kind of reminds me of because um, they used to use this feather quills in order to quill is a feather yeah uh, in order to like write down stuff kind of reminds me of education and learning something maybe expanding your knowledge about the things that you're doing okay let's see what the cards are telling us about your energy here hmm ten of swords come through this is actually something coming to an end you might have like a melodramatic reaction at the end of it because this can be something unexpected um this doesn't have to be uh like quitting your job or leaving where you are this can be maybe someone that you have a teammate is leaving but they are actually going for a better future the end of the journey now they're gonna actually upgrade to another level we have four of cups here four of cups kind of indicates maybe disappointment also the boredom maybe wherever you are or whatever the way the things are going you're going to be feeling a little bit bored about the situation which is a good thing because boredom actually pushes us to a creative new endeavor with the we have here the page of um pentacles which indicates that yes you're going to start to take um action towards something that is actually going to feel uh, like you're going to feel creative about which we have here the star card comes through i'm going to cover her up star means manifestation so this indicates that when you actually, uh, if, even if the things are not looking very bright on your end, um, you're going to get get it together and you're going to find a way to create some resources for yourself, start something new. And it seems like overall this is financial and um, you're going to be starting something good, better for yourself. And we have here the Queen of also fire is going to once fall through this is actually your energy this is your feminine side another creative side what she does is she does she makes her moves in silence even though the things are not really going the way you want it to be just put your creative ideas at work and keep your mo moves in make your moves in silence keep moving forward because you're going to be creating something that is um, magnificent eventually okay let's see what our 
the oracle cards are saying a loyal guardian you had a dog here a magical protector is there for you number 33 which means happiness and creativity and also protection indicates that um even though the things are not looking up um and i feel like overall the things are going to be looking up for you but there might be some you know because of maybe a planetary events and stuff like that i'm not really knowledgeable about those kind of things but things i don't know if it's going to positive or negative currently uh, it might affect you or there is a karmic lesson that you're completing but it is coming to an end you're completing that's done now and you are always being protected no matter which way the things are going okay right my beautifuls that's all for today hope you enjoyed your reading if you do don't forget to give this one a thumbs up and if you want to see more of these go ahead and subscribe to my channel i wish you all a magical day bye